Ozigbo tries it again, and this time he's in. On the 12th play of the drive, Nebraska with an early statement here in Columbus. Top 10 in the country, almost 50 yards per punt. Ohio State comes after it for good reason. Blocked out of the end zone. And so it's special teams putting its stamp on this game. You've got really your, your three-man wedge, but no one accounts for him because of the overload rush by the Buckeyes on the other side. So then it allows Jones to get to the punter as a free runner. From the 42-yard line, Haskins sets his feet. Time to throw, and a wide-open Johnny Dixon. Ohio State has the lead for the first time. It's going to be Johnny Dixon running across wide open. Doesn't get much easier than that. Well, here they go into the red zone where they were 0 for 5 and trying to score touchdowns against Purdue. Dobbins, stop and start. He's in. Touchdown, Buckeyes. Watch the left side of this offensive line. You talk about movement. They're able to position themselves to create a seam for J.K. Dobbins. And he's good enough to be able to find it and find the end zone. Here they've got it second and goal. Martinez keeps. He's in for the Nebraska touchdown. A little misdirection with the zone read. Special kid. He's got it first down and goal. He keeps it. He's got his second touchdown of this first half. And it's been off the zone read game. See how it freezes the defense. And then they rely on Adrian Martinez's ability to see the hole and make the cutback. Trying to hold Ohio State to a field goal or a touchdown to make it a two-score game. Late in the third. Campbell on the jet sweep. Paris Campbell, untouched touchdown. He's going to motion across and come back. And then really it's just that seam and the blocking on the outside. Touchdown, Buckeyes. A fake to Washington. Martinez scrambles. Sets his feet. Got hit as he throws. Down the sideline. Morgan's got it. There's the big play the Huskers were looking for. And how about the toughness of the true freshman? Steps up, heaves it, while getting knocked down by Tyreek Smith. And then Stanley Morgan on the other end going up and making a play right when they needed him to. They give it back to him here. Stop and start and explode. There goes J.K. Dobbins for an Ohio State touchdown. And watch the seam that's created for J.K. Dobbins. And really, it's just a bad run fit by Trey Neal, the safety for Nebraska. Had an opportunity. Martinez into the flats. That's Spielman. That's a touchdown. And the Huskers not dead yet. Back to within a score with 2.57 left. He's working on J.D. Spillman. He's got him in zone coverage. And it's the speed and really just the play design that gives him enough space to find the end zone. Coach, you told us during the week some glaring issues in the red zone and in the run game. Three for four touchdowns in the red zone today. Over 180 yards rushing just in the second half. What did you think about your team's response today? Well, I thought I'm so proud of the offense line. And there's not a group of guys that worked harder. I'm telling you now. Uh, I think we kind of eliminated a lot of the big play, too, on defense. We still got a long ways to go there. We were playing without Jeff Okuda. And uh, uh, then, obviously, Jordan Fuller got thrown out of the game because of uh, targeting. So we're still down bodies. Uh, but what we worked on, it worked. Let me ask you about that. So Jordan Fuller gets thrown out of the game. Brendan White comes in there. Now he's a kid whose dad is a legend here. Real emotional story with what he's battling. What did you think of how he responded today? Oh, I thought he played great. And uh, once again, I don't know exactly what he, you know, I, I saw him make a lot of plays. And and uh, you're right, his father's a dear friend of mine. And I was on the staff back when he played. And so uh, the White family's great. For you, you saw a big hit on your quarterback. He battled through. Were you concerned at how he was handling it? No, I wasn't concerned. I was very concerned that we had uh, three times. That was a miss uh, uh, ID by the tight end, and, and we had uh, three turnovers today. And you, you can't do that. Usually you don't win a, a game when you do that.